We are all anxious about the future of Europe. China's state-sponsored competition represents a threat to otherwise productive industries. The innovation gap is at the root of Europe's low in productivity growth relative to the US. So we must bring innovation back to Europe. A call for action from Mario Draghi as members of the European Parliament debated his proposals on how to make the EU economy more competitive. He says investment of 800 billion euros a year, a level not seen in Europe since the 1960s and 70s, is needed to stop the EU lagging behind other world powers. The former president of the European Central Bank warned that Europe's living standards and way of life are under threat unless swift action is taken and EU countries work together to raise funds. Draghi made three key recommendations, closing the innovation gap with the US and China, linking competitiveness to reduce carbon emissions and making the EU less vulnerable to foreign influence. MEPs agreed urgent measures are needed amid high prices for energy and goods and pressure on wages. Some members said the focus should now be on making sure key industries like vehicles and tech are innovative, competitive and stay in the EU. Many demanded greater investment in the green and digital transformations. Others argued for freer markets, increased powers at national level and warned measures to fight climate change can harm economic growth. Draghi's report is set to feed into MEP's future work as the new parliament sets its legislative agenda.